Can you solve this, my challenge? Here's the question. If x squared plus 9x minus 15 all over 2x squared minus 5x plus 3 equals 7 over 8, then what is the numerical value of x squared minus 14x plus 18 all over 3x squared plus 4x minus 12? You can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. Now, let's answer this question together. So, our basic goal here is to evaluate this expression x squared minus 14x plus 18 all over 3x squared plus 4x minus 12. Given this equation, x squared plus 9x minus 15 all over 2x squared minus 5x plus 3 equals 7 over 8. Now, how are we going to answer this kind of question? This is one thing I noticed in this question. If we subtract the numerator to the denominator, we get x squared minus 14x plus 18. So 2x squared minus 5x plus 3 minus the quantity x squared plus 9x minus 15. This will give us x squared minus 14x plus 18. And this is exactly the numerator that we want to evaluate. Also, if we add the denominator and the numerator, this will give us the value of 2x squared plus x squared will give us 3x squared. Negative 5x plus 9x is positive 4x. 3 plus negative 15 will give us negative 12. And that is exactly the denominator of the expression that we want to evaluate. So, this reminds me of the identity that it says that if we have a over b equals c over d, we have two equal fractions, then b minus a over b plus a equals d minus c over d plus c. Now, let's have some example to verify this identity. Now, let's have 3 over 5 equals 15 over 25. They are two equal fractions because 3 over 5 is the same thing as 15 over 25. If we simplify 15 over 25, we get 3 over 5. Now, let's do this identity b minus a over b plus a equals d minus c over d plus c. And take note that it says that they are still equal. So let's do that. So we have 5 minus 3 over 5 plus 3 equals 25 minus 15 over 25 plus 15. So let's verify this identity. 5 minus 3 over 5 plus 3, this will give us 2 over 8. 25 minus 15 over 25 plus 15, this will give us 10 over 40. Now, on the left side, 2 over 8 is just 1 fourth. And on the right side, 10 over 40 is still 1 fourth. Therefore, this identity is correct. So, let's use this to answer this question. Now, let's do b minus a over b plus a equals d minus c over d plus c. If we do that, we get this expression right here. And we know, if we subtract the numerator to the denominator, we get x squared minus 14x plus 18. And if we add them, we get the 3x squared plus 4x minus 12. This is exactly the expression that we want to evaluate. Now, on the right-hand side, we have 8 minus 7. This is just 1. And on the denominator, we have 8 plus 7, or simply 15. Therefore, the value of the expression that we want to evaluate is definitely equal to 1 over 15. And as always, we are done.